The Minnesota fishing opener is almost upon us, and for fishing guides across the state, the upcoming weekend is a big one. If you've ever been lucky enough to share a boat with one particular guide in the Grand Rapids area, you probably came away with more than a good stringer of fish. That's why Jeff Sundin's Early Bird Guide Service is the best in Minnesota. It's happening in driveways and garages all over the state. Jeff Sundin is prepping for the big weekend ahead, but unlike other anglers, Jeff's boat is his office. And the number of jigs he's tied in his life? Maybe 10 a day times 150 days times 33 years, at least a couple dozen. That sense of humor is kept in the side pocket of this fishing guide's tackle box amongst the jigs, spoons, and crankbaits ready to be used if the situation calls for it. That's part of the responsibility that I take more seriously all the time. It, it doesn't look like everybody's just enjoying themselves. Enjoying a day of fishing without being overly worried about what's in the live well is a trait that runs deep in this former city kid's gene pool. But the thing that really made the big difference to me was my grandparents. My grandma would take us on a walk. We'd go to one of the city lakes, and it was just fun. And it was stuff we were doing together. The family was all kind of involved. In 1985, Jeff's love for angling grew to the point where he wanted to make it his career. We were fishing, and when we were fishing, life was good. But these days, it's not all time spent in a boat. These days, I get up and write first, so I spend three or four hours in the morning on the computer before I ever leave the house. Keeping his web page up with timely information and working on fishing videos, Jeff is a very busy guy these days. I came up with a little jig that... And he's even found time for some product development with the well-known Lindy Tackle Company. And to borrow a phrase from Grandpa, we were going to catch him like nobody's business. But it's the memories created in the boat with clients he now calls friends that Jeff holds most dear, like guiding former Governor Jesse Ventura on his first Governor's Fishing Opener. When he caught the lake trout, he said, if that's not good enough for him, I'll turn this into the state fish. And he said, I can do that, you know. <laughs> he just wants fishing to be a fun and positive experience, whether it's their first trophy or a jaw-dropping sunset. Jeff is truly a keeper of his craft. I, I have been unbelievably lucky, you know, just to be able to do it and to be able to make a living at it.